The first day of spring usually means warmer weather, and for some, the time to panic about extra weight gained over winter. One mother and daughter will be ready for summer. Their replacement meal diet resulted in them losing 138 kilos between them. Georgia Main on how they did it. I used to weigh 166 kilos, and at the moment I weigh 76 kilos. I was 116, and now I'm 66 kilos. We know that people that follow them can expect to lose about 8 to 10% of their body weight in six months. Just over a year ago, 26-year-old Melody Ross was nearly too big to fit into these size 30 pants. I've always, like, I've been big study, like, from when I was, like, 12 to 13. That's when my weight started creeping up on me. And um, it just kept on going up and going up, not going down, it's always going up. Until eventually I just thought, I have to... I have to do something because my asthma was getting out of, out of control. With a lifetime diet of junk food and a weakness for chocolate, both mother and daughter ballooned. I've tried uh, Light and Easy, Zenical, Optifast, Ultra Slim, mm. Slim Fast, Xantrax, Weight, Weight Watchers. Watchers. Uh, Melody even had to order her clothes from interstate as most clothing stores only go up to a size 26. Yeah, I just thought I have to do something. And, and one, the seat, seat belt did not fit yeah, Even the seat belt did not fit in the, in the car. Finally, mother and daughter made a pact. They tried meal replacement diet, Celebrity Slim. I never thought in 16 months I'd come half of my size. Over half, actually, yeah. It's just amazing. I never knew I was, like, that big. Like, that, you know, I could fit my mum in one side and I'm in the other side. It's just amazing. I'm just actually really ashamed that I've gotten to this size. Biggest loser contestant, no, Cat White, is the Celebrity Slim the poster years, girl. She tipped the scales at 157.8 kilos and has lost nearly 60 kilos with a diet of determination and meal replacements. Obviously, a lot of my weight loss was accelerated through excessive training and things like that with the Biggest Loser. But since finishing The Biggest Loser, I'm maintaining and continuing to lose weight. Meal replacement diets are designed to replace two meals a day with a flavoured shake containing nutrients like green tea extract, calcium caseinate, whey and soy protein, reducing the amount of carbohydrates and kilojoules in your diet. Dietitian Dr Tim Crow. These products do just as well, if not better, than some traditional dieting approaches. For some people, they love the rigid advice of only drink a shake or eat a bar for one or two meals per day, and that's it. What do you think when you walk past McDonald's, you know, the fish and chip shop? I just think, oh, all those food was killing me. My dad passed away about seven years ago with a heart attack, and I could have had one. While Marilyn and Melody say they find their new diet easy to stick to, it has meant a huge adjustment. Just over a year ago, this was a typical day's food intake, and this is all they have now. There's no more like, takeaways or anything, no more cakes, chocolates. Australians are in a constant battle of the bulge, spending $500 million every year on various diets. The meal replacement market has a huge slice of that pie, with $300 million spent on programs such as Tony Ferguson, Shaw Slim and Optifast. Jeez. Yeah. Dr Crow says it's the convenience of meal replacements that makes them popular. And while they contain all the nutrients you need to be healthy, it's not all good news. Some of them can be expensive. They also don't teach you how to eat properly. Eventually you are going to have to stop using these products and eat normal food again. It changed my life. I feel fit. I feel very healthy. So no turning back? No, there's no turning back, definitely not. Because uh, 166, no way. What an achievement. Well done.